It's Rio Tuesday. But we get together every Tuesday night since I've been back to, uh, from Florida at Iggy's Sports Bar to indulge in food, him getting drunk, mocking me, and we just, it's playful banter that we thought you two would probably enjoy getting a kick out of. Be like a mini roast of me every single Tuesday. Yeah. And today, we're taking you along for the ride. I'm sorry. Hey, you got me in my wicked guitar solo. <clears throat> Okay, so... So, beers. <laughs> take two. Um, yes. Product placement. <laughs> uh, it's on the coaster, so you don't have to yell at me. <laughs> you like a retard, seriously, every time you're like, coaster placement table! <laughs> um, so, okay. First off, like I was saying, uh, you just, you notice, you know, when you grow a beard, that uh, your face, like I said, gets, it's, it's more warm. You know, not just the areas where you get the beard, but all over, yeah. all over the, it, your face does get a lot warmer, and it's, I mean, that's, that's a pretty cool thing, because it's getting, you know, <clears throat> later on in the year, and, uh, you like that seamless no, you transition. No, just kind of went through it, it was kind of yeah. cool. It's getting later in the year, it's getting kind of cold, so, um, <clears throat> you, you know, having every, every little layer helps out. Uh, secondly, uh, like I was saying before, again, um. I, I honestly do believe, though, that when you shave any part of your body, the hair, though, it's just your body doesn't create as much testosterone in the bloodstream. And, I mean, you know, you just, I don't know, that's, that's my personal belief. Uh, I'm, I might be wrong, but I'm probably not. I could be right. Just just to, just to agree with them. Yeah, it, it works out better that way. Not agreeing with them, just, No. <laughs> That doesn't work, period. I learned I mean, a long time ago. Yeah, you don't just, argue with Rio. No, nope, it just doesn't work. He'll make you so, cry in a corner. And again, maybe it's only a, a, you know, it's a perception thing. But when I grew my beard, I did feel more manly. I felt, you know, it, it was the epitome of, of doing something manly. Lumberjacks, uh, pirates, uh, not so much ninjas, because you can't see their faces, but they probably have beards. I mean, who knows? Little scraggly Asian beards. Um, the wisps that, that float around in the breeze yeah. as, they're, as they're running through. <laughs> so, was yeah, that, that a shadow? No. Yeah, those those Fu Manchu beards. Um, <laughs> no, you gotta do the one where they're like... Mm. Um, Sorry, I'm not Asian. I yeah, can't. It's okay. I, I tend to overlook it sometimes. Other times it's glaring omission. Um, no, but you do feel more manly. You really do. Because you always think of... You know, what's, what, what is manly things? Well, a chiseled jaw. You know, the, the square cut chiseled jaw mm -hmm. is something manly. Um, the rugged good looks. No, no pretty boy good looks. We're talking guys like, you know, Rock Hudson, uh, Gregory Peck, Sean Connery, you know, uh, uh, Jeremy Irons. These yeah, guys, yeah, yeah, yeah. these guys are rugged good looking. They also have the voice. Oh, exactly. A lot of power in the voice. The thing is, though, that you don't realize, other than Rock Hudson, they all had beards at some point in their lives. Yeah. Glorious beards, too. Yeah. I mean, you've got uh, Sean Connery, known for his beard, right? Uh, Jeremy Irons, again, kind of known for his beard. Uh, Gregory Peck, not known for his beard, because he was normally clean-shaven. However, he was Captain Ahab in That's Moby right. Dick, and That's he right. had a great beard for that. And that was his actual beard, not a fake one. So, you got Gregory Peck with the beard. And it's, you know, you just, like, the combination of that, that manly, rugged face, the voice, the, the amazing voice, and a beard. It's, you got everything manly right there. So, that's, that's my ideas on, on a beard, is it's, it's just sort of, I don't know, something every guy has to try. It might not work for every guy. You plus, know? plus, most beards are kind of like a, a sign of, like, a passage or stuff. Like, yeah, hockey. They always do it. Oh, yeah. Like, uh, for... Um, in hockey, they don't shave during the entire playoffs. Yeah, if and as long as they're doing as, as well, we might as well mention um, also. It's still November. It is November, as so, as you can see. Rio's sporting it as as I'm as am I. Yeah, I can't grow here. Derek gives me. I'll Photoshop it in. Yeah, Derek. <laughs> Derek always makes fun of me for that, but uh, I can't. I'm okay with it. <clears throat> but it is November, and uh, November, as we both know, is um, don't shave for all of November. Try and grow either a beard or a mustache uh, in your support for uh, men's fight against prostate cancer, which right. 
it's it's definitely something. It's a cause you can get behind. You know, uh, you're no one's gonna fire you because you're growing a mustache. Right? Unless you're in the food industry and yeah, you wear one of those little. Yeah, but then you're gonna wear the cool like the cool makes you look like Santa things. Claus. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Oh, yeah, exactly. kids, shut up, Derek. Yeah. Just get me more bruschetta. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> That's why they won't let me in the kitchen anymore. I, I thought that's why they wouldn't let you in your kids anymore. But <laughs> that's secretly why I left Disney. <laughs> hey, little Michael kid. Jackson 2.0. <laughs> oh. Um, so yeah, like we said, it's it's Movember, so that's always a good thing. But uh, yeah, like um, like Derek said, you know, it's it's a sign of dedication as well. Um, because it takes a lot to grow up. It, it does. I mean, even if you can't grow one, like, if you try to grow one and you get, like, this little scraggly, like, yeah, like, really stuck, you never, catchy one, yeah, you, you, don't want, you don't want to try to continue to grow it. Sidney Crosby, for example, yeah. looks like a pedophile when he tries to grow his beard. He looks like a pedophile anyway, because I hate Sidney Crosby, but, yeah, basically. No, because it, it no, is I, a hard yeah, thing. No, 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 I know. And it's, it's different strokes for different folks, because, you know, some people grow great beards, like Derek's beard here. Uh, my beard. Well, I don't know. See, because I, I got the, like the gold, like the blonde right here, and like you can mine's see right red. Here, like right here's white. Well, yeah, but mine's red. So I mean, give me a break. You know, it's it's red and blonde. Okay, Conan. It's it's all the uh, Norse Viking blood in, in my family. Thanks a lot, Ma. Um, but <laughs> no, it's it it is hard for some people though. Yeah. You know, and I I, I honestly kind of feel bad for them. Not because I'm like, oh, you can't grow a beard. <laughs> but it's... Yes, as you're stroking <laughs> the beard. <laughs> yeah, no, it's it's not that. It's We should do an Old Spice commercial for <laughs> beards. No, there was that Old Spice commercial. Yeah, there already. was. Yeah. But, because, uh, you know, some people do grow it, and they genuinely want to grow a beard. And it comes in patchy. Mm -hmm. You know, and I, I feel really bad for that, because that's... You can't change that. That's just no. genetics, you know. It's like, I wish I could grow here so I could complete it, but... My genetics don't allow for that. My well, brother unless, does, you, unless you keep shaving. No, that's an urban legend, actually. That is an urban legend. Yes, it is a myth. Because that's what I tried. It's a myth. If you yeah. keep shaving, it's not going to grow in any thicker, and it's not going to grow in, in places that it normally wouldn't. It is it is a myth. Huh. Yeah. One thing, there's a couple things you can try, though. Um, you can stimulate the, uh, the uh, area, the skin, with eucalyptus oil, 100% eucalyptus oil. And taking a vitamin, it's a water-soluble B vitamin called biotin, and it actually um, it helps with nail development and hair growth. And uh, it'll honestly, everybody who grows a beard should do should do that anyway because hey, it just makes your hair that much healthier, you know. And luxurious. Yes, yes. It's like a uh, it's like giving your dog uh, raw eggs. You know how it makes their coat like lustrous. Biotin. Mm. Yeah, like that. And condition your beard. Shampoo and condition yeah. your beard. That otherwise, is otherwise, it gets dried out. Like it can, no yeah, it gets dried. It's scratchy. It's like a Brillo pad. You know, and, and if you got a lady friend, you don't want her like rubbing up against that and coming away with rug burn. No, if you want, if you're gonna get rug burn with a lady nope, friend, no, nope. edit portion. Yeah. <laughs> Scene missing. Um, <laughs> it is true. So you gotta remember to shampoo and condition your beard. However, um, you can't. Uh, you can't just use regular conditioner. You got to use a more gentle one because the skin underneath the beard is still normal skin that's not used to having shampoo and conditioner on it, and that'll get dried out as well. Yeah. So, you know, that's just how it goes. Basic beard tips, you know. I mean, granted, most people can't pull off a mustache any better than they can a beard because yeah. they end up looking like. Bad file. Yeah. You were gonna, you, I thought you were gonna throw like looking like Derek in there. I was, I was expecting it. I was getting ready for a rebuttal, and then you didn't. And um, no, I just, it's, it's, I just actually ground that in so you could just completely take that. It's, it's basically because pedophile and Derek are synonyms for me. So, whenever I say pedophile, I mean him basically. Uh, the two, one thing that every person who owns a mustache or a beard should have is this. This is a uh, great. Beard comb. I'm not gonna like name drop or anything, but always get a beard comb because um, you never know when it's gonna come in handy. I've got a bit of a thicker beard than Derek does. It's true. Um, mine's more curlier. Yeah. Well, mine gets curly too, but just yeah. not not so much. But um, you know, this always comes in handy. Uh, honestly, it's like a girl's brushing her hair. What, like 200 brushes a day or something like that's supposed to keep your hair really soft and everything. Something like that. Yeah. yeah. It's same goes for guys. To be honest, if you 
if you brush, yeah, <laughs> you know, invite your guy friends over, have a beard brushing party, you know. Hope Derek doesn't show up real tight. Edit this portion. Um, this is going to be so awkwardly transitioned because I'll be like, I'll be like, because then Derek, the beard comb is really, <laughs> yeah. Nothing, nothing makes you look at least a bit more manly than just sitting on a park bench one day and being like, that guy looks pretty tough. I could probably take him though. Mm. Is that my fault? No, okay. Right. Oh, it's just you, okay. Penny for your thoughts now. I should pick up some bagels. Hmm. Yeah. Pick up a beard comb. I have two of them, see? And actually, uh, this came from... Um, yeah, it came from uh, my uh, trimmer kit. And this is the one I use to... Uh, What's the bottom part? Uh, uh, just to look pretty. Maybe. I don't know, actually. Maybe it's... It's probably there to trim. You know, I've been using the other side to trim, but you're probably right. See, that's... You learn new things when you talk about beer to people. Or true. every once in a while, I just come up with some witty, stupid thing that actually that makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Let it be known now, YouTube. <laughs> yeah. So, we we basically spent this entire time talking about uh, mustaches and beards, which is a bit awkward, to be honest. As we've had awesome music playing in the background, provided by Rio's computer, yeah. that you probably can't hear. No, but it's it is definitely good. Hold on. Take you there. Bonus points if you know what song this is. It's a, it's a good song, man. Good song. Every Tuesday, leave a comment in the doobly-doo down below, but every Tuesday we will come up with topics that you want us to discuss. Now, Rio can come up with anything on the spot. I sometimes need to do a little bit of research just to make it look like I'm not that stupid. Actually, that takes a lot of research, but... We do what we can. So leave topics of what you want us to discuss. It won't be just about Disney. That's for my other videos. To topic Tuesdays are for you guys and for Rio, too. We'll, we'll, we'll give Rio the shout-out. Uh, you, you guys probably really want to post some topics because you don't want to hear the stuff that I have to talk about. So really post topics. Otherwise, this, this vlog is going to go downhill really fast. <laughs>